My final stop in East London is with freelance illustrator Akraf. Now, he was born in 1988 in Brussels, and he's a young, creative, free-minded person that seriously knows how to express himself. His illustrations are really memorable and unique, which is something so refreshing to see. And he's about to release his very own illustration publication. I can't wait to see more of his work. Stephanie, how are you? I'm great, <laughs> how are you? Good, good. Um, I'm currently with Ashraf and Marie, and you're exactly. a freelance illustrator here in yeah. East London. Um, could you tell me a little bit about what you're doing right now? Well, I'm actually working on a project uh, which is uh, creating a logo for a fresh new brand coming up soon. Um, so could you tell me a little bit about your background and how you developed your own style and what inspired you to become an illustrator? So, yes, drawing is something I'm doing since I'm Quite, I was quite small, I would say, when I was a kid. And obviously I was kind of imitating what I was watching while I was a child, like all these anime, cartoons. Uh, what I'm doing now, it's more kind of personal and for my own kind of inspiration, I would yeah. say, globally. So I've started traveling, meeting yeah. people, uh, you know, falling in love, you know, all those emotions that everybody, <laughs> you know, start knowing yeah. once in their life. There are a lot of emotions, I will say, in my illustrations. This is why sometimes they are completely crazy, as all emotions are. I mean, depending on how you feel, they come out, and that's it. Yeah. It's really pure. What you see, it's really what I am. OK, so you're saying it's really pure. Yes. And you're so sweet. You've got the biggest smile <laughs> on your face. I know what you're you want. You're <laughs> talking about being in love and inspiring you. So why, why is it so dark, you know? like. In every beauty, there is a dark a part of the darkness. Otherwise, you will not. I mean, it's like yin and yang. Nothing goes without the other. And so, tell me, how long does it take for you to create an image with color and pens and like the different shapes and styles you've got going on here? Like, how long, roughly, would it take? Well, everything is really is quite quick. I will say. Um, the main thing for me is to have the, the concept. Yeah. Once I have the idea of what I want to do, it, it comes naturally outside, you know, it's like talking. I really appreciate when the sketchy aspect uh, is still visible, you know. Yeah. So this is why I will not give my, permit myself to spend more time than an hour, roughly, by colouring, drawing, everything. An hour? An hour, I would say, yeah. Um, could you tell me who you've created images for? Well, mainly it's for, I will say, media and stuff, like magazines, yeah. uh, fashion, mm -hmm. which is our big, um, biggest client I've got here. As I say always, I mean, everything, every creation starts with a drawing, you know, so yeah. it's applicable in everything. So, obviously, you've just mentioned about illustration being a really big part of fashion, um, and you're creating your own illustration magazine, is that right? Yeah, that's correct. So I'm launching my first ever magazine um, by the end of this month, actually. Wow. It's more like a um, project that I'm going to do with other creatives, because mm -hmm. London is plenty of them. And yeah, to, just to see how they function if I give them a brief this time. I'm not the one who received a brief, but I'm the one who suggests something, a concept. And just to see how they will interpret it and the idea. The, the title of my magazine is Illustration. Right. which is a fusion of basically what I'm doing here. Uh, it's illustration, it's fashion, and it's a bit trashy, I will say. Well, you know, thank you so much for letting us look into your world and thank you so much. more about you. Thanks for having me. Well, actually, I won't, leave, I won't let you leave before having a, a sketch of you. Really? If it's possible. Of course. Yeah? yeah? What's it going to come out like? It's how I will see you, so oh, let's take a pose. <laughs> OK. Let's take a pose. OK. <laughs> Shall we go? Let's do this. Yeah. Here we go. That is <laughs> amazing. 
amazing. Do you think it looks like me? I can definitely see <laughs> a resemblance there. Tell me, I've got a question though. Tell me. You've not made me quite as dark as some of the other characters. I'm not quite as eerie. Well, you know, the interpretation I've got of you now, right now, I mean, it's more like, I mean, a happy mood now, I would say, <laughs> yeah. Maybe the orange and the zebras. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I can see the yeah. zebras have made an appearance in this as well, so it's definitely a hit. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I absolutely love it.